we're going to be talking about IRR. What is it? Why is it important? And I even built a tool to help you calculate it. All right, what is IRR? If you Google it, you'll probably notice it stands for internal rate of return. But you'll probably also notice it gives you this really complicated formula and doesn't really tell you what any of this means. To make matters worse, you actually can't calculate IRR by hand, which is why I made this IRR calculator to make things simpler. To really understand IRR, we first must understand that time is money. And the more money we can get sooner, the more valuable the investment is. And that's the whole point of the IRR calculator. As we add more money to year one, uh, in this investment scenario, the IRR goes up tremendously. But if we try to add that same amount to year four, we see that it doesn't increase at the same rate. If we take out year one cash flows, we can see that IRR is starting to drop. And as we take out year two, it starts to go down even more. The beauty of the internal rate of return is now that we can compare two different investments using this percentage and make a decision on which investment we should go forward with. You want to really be careful not to focus in too much on this one data point. This is just one metric to help you compare investments and make a decision. By no means is the ultimate thing that should help to drive you for your decision making. If you learned something on this video, follow Matt Loves Tech on TikTok, YouTube, everything. Thank you for watching and I hope you learned.